Hi kids! This is Teacher May, your teacher for today. Please don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for the latest videos. Before we start our new lesson, let's have a short review. Find the product of the following numbers. Let us answer this problem. Sarah saves a portion of her daily allowance. She saves 15 pesos every day for Christmas. How much will she save in 40 days? How will you get the total savings? From the responses, which will give you the answer easily? Why? Today, we will be solving word problems on multiplication. Let us recall the steps in problem solving. U-P-A-C or think, plan, solve, and look back. Number one, understand the problem. Think. Identify what are the given and what is asked. Two, devise a plan. Plan. Choose an appropriate strategy in solving the problem. Number three, answer or carry out the plan or solve. After identifying a strategy to use, solve and answer the problem. Number four, check or look back. Have time to reflect and look back on what you have done, what worked and what did not work. What words imply multiplication? Now, let us recall the parts of a division sentence. In 30 divided by 6 equals 5. 
we have the division sign equal sign and 30 is the dividend 6 is the divisor and 5 is the quotient in 48 divided by 5 equals 9 remainder 3 3 is the remainder Problem solving on multiplication. Let us solve the following multiplication story. After a typhoon, 1,200 people were brought to an evacuation center. The local government provided three meals a day for each evacuee for 12 days. How many meals did the local government provided in all? Step 1. Think what are given in the problem. What is asked in the problem? Step 2. Plan. Step 3. Solve. Step 4. Look back. Let us solve another problem. Example, Adele bought 4 sets of uniforms. She paid 640 pesos for each set. She gave 3,000 pesos to the cashier. How much change did she get? Step 1. Think. Given 4 sets of uniform, 640 pesos each set, 3,000 pesos payment. Asked, how much change did she get? Step 2. Plan. Hidden question, what is the total cost of the uniforms? Number sentence, 3,000 minus 640 times 4 equals N. Step 3, solve. 640 times 4 is equal to 2,560. 3,000 minus 2,560 is equal to 440. Answer, she got a change of 440 pesos. Step 4, look back. Review your answer. Is it correct? Answer this activity. Solve on your own. Follow the steps in problem solving. Dividing 3 to 4 digit by 1 digit numbers without regrouping. What do you call a natural calamity brought by strong winds with heavy rains that may cause flood, landslide, and destruction of structures? Write on the line the letter corresponding to the quotient to decode the word.
divide using pictorial representation. Place value discs. 426 divided by 2. On a place value chart, form 426 using discs. Group the discs under each place values by twos as shown below. Six thousand nine hundred five divided by three. In a place value chart, form six thousand nine hundred five using discs. Group the disc under each place value by threes. Under the ones column, there are one group of three and a remainder of two. Divide using long division. Recall DMBS. Divide, multiply, subtract, and bring down. In long division, we write the dividend inside the division house and the divisor outside the division house. To easily remember the division process, we think of the members of the family who lives in the house. Representation DMSB Dad, Mom, Sis, and Bro 426 divided by 2, divide 400s by 2. 2 times 200s is equal to 400s. And then subtract. 4 minus 4 is 0. Bring down 2 tens, divide 2 tens by 2. And then subtract. 2 minus 2 is 0. Bring down 6 ones, divide 6 ones by 3. 2 times 3 is equal to 6 ones, and then subtract. 6 minus 6 is 0. Six thousand nine hundred five divided by three. Divide six thousands by three. Three times two thousands is equal to six thousands, and then subtract. Six minus six is zero. Bring down nine hundreds. Divide nine hundreds by three. 3 times 3 hundreds is equal to 9 hundreds. And then subtract, 9 minus 9 is 0. Bring down 0 tens, divide 0 tens by 3. 3 times 0 tens is equal to 0 tens. And then subtract, 0 minus 0 is 0. Bring down 5 ones. Divide 5 ones by 3. 3 times 1 ones is equal to 3 ones. And then subtract. 5 minus 3 is 2. Answer this activity. Find the quotient of the following numbers using the corresponding methods. 0.5 